keep the people poor, keep them fighting each other, keep them using drugs and alcohol to get over the despair, keep them down. Genocide. Justice is like Yellow Thunder Camp. Oh. Four years, four minutes. on white clay all the sales of alcohol here for our children our next generations for the people and all the deaths that are happening here because of alcohol we want them out of here we want them out of here in 30 days or change their business everyone's affected and we're tired of it we don't want it no more no more alcohol We had people from Albuquerque there, Colorado, someone from Seattle. We had people from Lincoln. We had people from, you know, a lot of different areas come out and do this. We did a blockade of the road, and it was basically there were there were there were U locks that people had. Um, Walk to their neck and then the chain going across the road. And we're here to show the world that the genocide of indigenous cultures is over. The resistance movement's growing. And we're here to shut down white clay. They're blocking white clay over here on that side, but we're blocking here on this side. All these people right here, most of them are non-natives, and they've taken a, a strong, they've taken a strong part in you know helping and supporting the Vala people. 
you know, to help shut down white clay and to, you know, oppose all the deaths and the alcohol and the suicide and the pollution that's been put upon our people. And, you know, I'm really thankful and everything like that to be a part of this and everything, as everybody else, I believe, you know, truly honestly believe are, you know, it's, it's a wonderful event right now. We're taking a strong stance of resistance. Most of the tribe and everything like that probably walked away and everything, but, you know, we're taking a lot stronger opposition right now. Resistance! United States. Well then go back on go back to Germany. This is our shit. This is our land. This is our Why don't you go back to Europe? Why don't you go fucking Why don't you go back to Germany? I don't have the resource to put a man here 24-7 now. Well I I've been working on this problem a long time and, and I wished I had a magic wand to take care of. Alcohol and drugs are no good. We have a lot of boys in the pen, in jail, everything. It's no good. We want to stop this. Keep fighting. Yeah. Keep going. Yeah, yeah, Pop Poimer said, uh, put the roadblock down and go eat now. No. Our, our coordinator for DGR, he asked him ahead of time if that would be, you know, okay to proceed. And, you know, feeling that, at least in that situation, since it was, you know, this is the annual march, and his, you know, that his brother was the one who died, you know, asking him. And he told us it was fine to go ahead with it. I thought this was a day of unity, of solidarity. Where are, where are they? Where is everybody? The where is everybody? These women have decided to make this decision for themselves. Not one time did you allow them to speak at your thing. So now they're, they're going to lock down. So we ask you, my thing. We ask you respectfully to step aside and, and let the them next do their thing. you start singing, you respect that drum. That's the heartbeat of our drum. Of our the heart. people's, not yours. Well, then you should have respected. No, them. you should respect the people before you start it's moving. Okay, but now, we were just here. But you know, we're demonstrating. We're not trying to fight with you guys. Hey. We came and talked to you before we came and locked down, and you um, felt that it was okay to get an action. These folks that are locked down here are following indigenous lead, and that's what we need in this country for a revolution. Which group are you guys on? That's what we need. I don't need that on. Take that away from me. Take that. Shut that off. Yeah, we don't need shut that. Shut that off. Shut it off. Shut that off. Shut that off. Hey, 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 hey. Don't even get close to I my dad. Don't even shut that off. Hey. Nobody's doing this. Hey, shut that up. People who are scared of cameras are guilty. So what's the media doing here for me? You're defending me. Oh, yeah. Once we saw that we weren't going to leave, uh, you know, it came down and you know, because he wanted to take part in the blockade too. But then the incident happened with uh, one of our members being uh, assaulted, so they were asked to leave. He was definitely security for tribal council. He pulled me, he pulled my shirt, and he kind of pulled me, flew him a bit, and he was like, hey, baby, so 
me to, he came on to me and like, you know, put his hands on me. And I was like, I pushed him away. I said, you know, get your hands off me. And I brought this to the, the attention of, of Tom. I kind of said, all right, well, this man who's in the tribal, who's doing security for the tribal council, he, you know, insulted me. After that, they all kind of left and packed up before the agreement was written, legal agreement between the women and then the police. Relatives, I want to say DGI, they're not!